In 2005, deep in the Costa Rican rainforest, a tribal elder had a vision. A vision that would see the first ever female chief of their people, as well as an end of years of sexual oppression against women and children. This vision would set into motion people and events that would forever change long-standing traditions of the Nagabe Bugal tribe. My name is Colby Hall, and I, along with a team of award-winning filmmakers, has been asked to tell this amazing story by producing a feature-length documentary. This documentary tells a powerful story of hope and restoration and highlights the journey of a faithful man that would be tested to his very core. Carlos Alberto, or Pluma Blanca as the indigenous people call him, is a man that has dedicated his life to serving the indigenous people of Costa Rica. Carlos comes from very humble beginnings, growing up very poor, and was homeless for much of his youth. But God called him to many great things, and as he kept moving forward, he has been used in ways he could never have imagined. Carlos started a nonprofit organization called Fundieca. While working in one of the indigenous reserves of Costa Rica, Carlos witnessed a dark tradition firsthand that would chill him to the bone. Carlos witnessed young women crying while being given away by their families to older chiefs who already had many wives. Carlos soon learned that sexual abuse was something that was deeply entrenched under the surface of the people he was serving. Carlos was told of the vision that the elder had many years before about the coming of the first female chief. And his resolve for combating these evil traditions were restored when he met Andalia Andrade, the woman that will become chief of her people on April 23rd, 2022. Upon sharing this vision with me, I have felt nothing but compassion for Carlos and the indigenous people of Costa Rica and wish to aid them in this fight against this dysfunctional tradition in the only way I can. My mission is to produce a feature-length documentary detailing the tragic history of this tradition and the bright future as Adalia takes her place in history. Once the film is finished, my hope is to premiere it at multiple film festivals around the globe, raising the support and awareness necessary to make Carlos's fight of giving the oppressed a voice. I have assembled a team of multi-award winning filmmakers who are ready to aid me in making this dream a reality. However, the only way we can truly make this project come to life is with your help. With your contributions, my team and I will be able to travel to Costa Rica and create this documentary, as well as market it to the film festivals after the final product has been completed. When you contribute to this project, you are supporting more than just a film. You are contributing to help fight against sexual oppression amongst the indigenous peoples of Costa Rica. Help us fight this fight by contributing to this fundraising campaign or contact our team at plumablancafilm at gmail.com to see other ways you can provide support. We hope to see you join us on the front lines of this mission to help build a better future for the indigenous people of Costa Rica. Thank you.